Next, I'd like to invite our comrade from Japan to come up and say a few words to you. Hi, everyone. No, I just have, thanks for thank you very much for inviting me over to Marxism 2012. This was a great opportunity for me to pass on the messages, pass on uh, the the situations uh, and people's convictions, Japanese people's convictions to you. I think I was a messenger. I just told you the you know what was going on in Japan at the moment or in the past year, and I heard from several people. That it was, uh, my talk was a little bit kind of discouraging and <laughs> disappointing because it's not, uh, uh, it's not a happy story. There's always, like you said, a struggle. And people are, uh, like we talked about throughout this week, the money speaks. And that's what's happening in Japan. Uh, Tepco, Tokyo Electric Power Company is very strong and um, like you know I'm very strong in the things and workers' rights and that's what we see every day. Workers are defeated and working class is defeated and people are disposed of every day, you know? But when 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 you have a struggle you have you realize that you have comrades, supporters and it really gives them us great power and it's very empowering and that's what we not want to that's what we want to feel that's what we need to feel and at the moment people in Japan are struggling having the hardest times of their lives but as I told you and as I brought their stories to you this week um, we want you to think about it and we want you to think about these people and it's not just other people's problems, but it's your problem too, and your struggles. Like like Bastio was, was saying, it's one world, one struggle, one pain. And so um, I would like uh, to I'll, when I go back, I'll tell everyone about uh, the support that I have here, um, and it's going to it's going to empower them in their own story. This is the very important, they're a very critical moment in, in Japan and especially in the uh, anti-nuke uh, movement. We only have one plant working right now and May 5th is the day the last one stops. And this is a very important day for all of us, uh, not just people in Japan but people in the world who, the, to, who live in the, the land that have nuclear power plants and also uranium mines uh, the countries that, that plan to build nuclear power plants. So we have to be connected, we have to connect with each other. Um, like I said, there are a lot of defeats, but every defeat we stand up, we know to rise up. And every time we learn how to rise up better and stronger, and we know that, and this is what we are doing in Japan, and so please rise up with us, and um, one thing that you can do, of course, I said that in in your own homeland, you, you could you know you could do the protest against uranium mines and everything else, but directly uh, to help Japan and the Japanese people and the, the Occupy movement slash uh, anti nuke movement, you can send um, encouraging messages, solidarity messages to the people who are at the tent, and also. Um, through video clips or through um, sending uh, sending uh, postcards to this one house, it's called Asako House in the northern part of Japan, in the northern <coughs> island because this woman uh, resisted she didn't sell her land and that's why the power plant is still in planning stage, and this is a very important. Uh, this is a very important thing. And uh, she's unfortunately she's passed passed away a few years ago, but her daughter is carrying on this is uh, this conviction. And what in Japan, what we're trying to do is that because the um, the government has been so desperate to build the nuclear power plant. 
they've been researching how much traffic was going through this one road to her place, Asako House. And when the traffic thins out, the company and the government will come in and then ask the to give her the eviction order. So what we're trying to do is send postcards so that mail uh, postman goes there every day. Right? Um, and it's very important to continue doing this, continue sending postcards to her place. Um, I will, or someone probably can f find out the address, but I will send the address to someone who's connected here. Um, so please do send encouraging messages to show that there are people in Australia in solidarity with this movement. This is very important. Um, so uh, it's, as I heard, it might have been kind of discouraging, but it is the fact, but we need to know the fact and reality. Uh, I tend to be very realistic, but I could sound very pessimistic too at the same time. But to know the reality, to know what's going on, and then this is very important to build strategy, I think, in the future, and in our movement for the future, so to push forward our movement. And so I would like you to be in with in on uh, this movement with us. Um, it's uh, it's very important. And I'm supposed to sing international. <laughs> of course, this song is great because uh, I saw all these international guests. It was great that I talked to everyone who came to this conference. It was uh, very empowering and inspiring to me. But these international guests who are sitting here, we have in Japan, we have the support, uh, solidarity movement in Japan, every one of them. And uh, and it's very, to me, It's I see the common interest, common struggle, common uh, the solidarity, international solidarity work that I feel at home, uh, that I see here. Um, and when, uh, because I'm in some trade unions, when we sing, when we have this kind of uh, union gathering, we have, union members from all across the world. And one song we sing together is the international. Uh, because in different languages, in your own language. And that's, that's, that's why it's very good. And it's, that's why it's called international. But Kay, I think you're going to help me. I think, I think we'll do that in like 10 minutes. Oh, OK. <laughs> yeah, it's all right. All right, OK. But, uh, so thank you very much, and I will, one favor I actually want to ask you is, I want to physically take back this um, heat and this solidarity <laughs> commitment. So I will be going around videotaping your messages. So if you have things to say, and if you want to show your support, please come to me, and I'll be videotaping your message. I will put Japanese subtitles on it, and I will show it to, uh, to the people. It's fun. Woo!